stars we made stars. We are in Jerez in the south of Spain, a former Grand Prix circuit and we are doing a driver search which means we are looking for young, this time very young drivers for our junior program. The history is very long and very successful I don't know exactly when it started, but we had driver searches in Europe, in the US. US, for example, a guy named Scott Speed came around. He made it to Formula One. And in Europe, yeah, it was Ricciardo, Pierre Gasly. We got world champions as well. It's, I think it's known four times, Sebastian Vettel three times, hopefully this year another fourth title for Max. So the selection was done with drivers who are the youngest is just 13 years old. The oldest, oldest is 16 years old. But basically they all are coming out of go-kart. What is important here that we see most of them are the first time in a Formula car. How do they adapt? How quickly are they progressing? And how is their improvement during a two-day test? You know, we start with old tires and new tires, and we really focused how good are they under pressure and under qualifying simulations. This driver should be in a position to win a Grand Prix. We give them the chance with massive financial support. They can use our simulators in Milton Keynes. They will look after with uh, physical and also nutrition program 
and they also overlook that uh, training is done in the right direction because in motor racing you have to have a very strong neck and you have to be always at least one category ahead. So it's an, I would say, perfect preparation for Formula One. Hi, I'm Finn McLaughlin. I'm 16 years old from Northern Ireland. I've been part of racing for 10 years. And this year I've been competing in the Army Euro Series FI Current Championship and the Champions of the Future. What's your goal in racing? To be a world champion. Well, my dad did it to begin with, so when I, well, I was a wee, wee baby watching my father drive around my home track, and I was always at a, a track since the age of, I don't even know, I was that young. And there was, I loved watching Sebastian Vettel. He was the person that really got me into. He was always an inspiration to me. Just the way his personality is some, something I would like to be. Well, I, I'll never give up. That's the main thing. And I work hard until I'm at the top. And if it takes as long as it does, I'll keep working until I'm there. And that's the difference. People give up, but me, I, I never give up. Uh, well, today I had to jump into a GP3 for the first time. So that was the biggest challenge, taking me out of my comfort zone. So. I just had fun, tried to do my best, and I'm happy with the job I've done. Hello, my name is Scott Kinnemdom, and I'm 14 years of age, and I'm from Sweden. I started karting uh, at the age of five, and I've been racing it for nine years now. I started in a very low class in Sweden, and I just worked my way from Mini 60 to OKJ, and now OK Senior. My goal is to be a Formula One world champion. It's been good and challenging, of course. It's been very, it's two very hot days here in Juarez. My biggest challenge was adjusting driving style from casting to F4 because it's my first time in an F4 car. And my engineer helped me a lot to try and change that and try and improve myself. It means a lot to me to be a part of this Red Bull Academy and I'm sure it will help me a lot. My plan for this year is con to continue the, in the OK Senior class in karting and then next year I will also stay in karting in the same category and then next year after that, 2026, I will go up into Formula 4 cars.